of the newest trends in the local food movement is urban beekeeping. I recently talked to Chuck Wood of the newly opened Woods Bees in Lincoln, Rhode Island, and he told me all about his new shop and about this growing trend. As it turns out, you actually get more honey keeping bees in a city than you do out in the country. When I talked to him, he explained all the benefits of keeping bees from the flowers and pollination for your fruit crops to the honey that you get um, at the end of the season and throughout the year. His bees weren't active at the time because they do kind of go a little bit dormant during the winter season. But now that the flowers are out in bloom, you should be seeing those bees all around picking up the pollen from the dandelions, from whatever flowers are blooming right now. One of the benefits of having bees, of course, beyond pollination, is also having honey. Local honey is extremely valuable as an allergy remedy because it contains little bits of a lot of the pollens and the particles that people are allergic to. And so if you take a little bit of honey each day leading up to allergy season, you can actually reduce your allergies just by using local honey. Honey is actually also very antiseptic. It's good for the skin. It's very moisturizing. I talked to Mary Blue of Pharmacy Herbs about some of the benefits of local honey. She stressed that it is important to get that local honey so that you know where the bees were getting the pollen from and so that you get your honey from a trusted beekeeper. She says they use honey in a lot of their salves, in a lot of their ointments and things for the skin. She also recommends it for local allergies. And she also recommends it for things like a sore throat or anything um, that needs a little bit of soothing like the skin if it's raw. Um, she also says that honey makes a very good little chocolate truffle and you roll it with some chocolate, uh, roll it with a little bit of cocoa powder. It's your fun fact for the day that honey's actually been found in some of the ancient Egyptian tombs. And when they opened it up, they found that it was still good because honey is so antimicrobial and antibacterial that nothing would grow on it even after all those years in the tomb. So pick up some local honey. You can get it at Pharmacy Herbs um, along with some of the farmers markets around here. And if you're interested in beekeeping, Apparently it's a lot of fun. You can talk to Chuck Wood up at Woods Bees. He can give you all the advice, get you some hives going. And if you would prefer, you can even have him come tend some hives on your property so you can get the honey without having to worry about being stung by those bees. Well, you can go to Woods Bees. He actually will have bees in this spring. He has kind of starter kits um, that you can use. And as long as you have access to the outdoors, you don't want to obviously put your beehive inside. But if you have a porch, just set it right on that porch and the bees will be happy.